Uh, last episode, uh, we decided to uh, expand outwards to the next tile, and that's what we've done. So as you can tell, we've almost reached the um, train line here. And if we get out of free cam here, you can see we don't really have enough space to go around. And we're still growing very quickly here. So what I'm thinking for this episode is we're going to expand out industry and then add in a commercial zone along this area. And then we'll get some train lines going. And hopefully by the end of this episode or the next episode uh, we'll fill out this tile, tire, um, tile and then we can buy another one and maybe expand out our forestry operation to this beach area and maybe get some um, leisure going around the uh, sandy shores there. So without further ado let's uh, hop back in. It's actually been quite some time since I've uh, played this and right now I'm just curious on how I should approach this. Like I think I think we should start building some commercial areas first. So what we can do is uh if my computer can catch up. There we go. Uh let's get that tool. We'll plop some building buildings down there so that uh, they'll have to drive here. And also that'll set up uh, some commercial on this end. So it's um, it's been a while and I totally forgot about the fishing dock. Yeah. Uh, I, and yeah pretty much I have been playing Fallout playing a little bit of um, Insurgency since uh, I got a lot of free time on my hands and Sadly, I have to tell you guys that my computer is about to fucking die. <laughs> like, if if you notice from this series or like this this episode, like you know, you'll notice there will be a little bit more lag than usual, and I think it's because my computer or my graphics card is actually going to plummet. It's gonna actually die. Like, like it's surprising that I've had it for like five six years now and so far it hasn't really given me a lot of trouble until now um, we could get a cargo terminal going here Ooh, I actually would like that if I could if I could place the cargo terminal here how would my power situation look the power situation would look pretty pretty good, yeah, okay. I'll accept that. Uh let's let's get a train line going. Uh let's get some curved units here. I kinda go like that and then maybe just the straight one here. Just to just hook it up to this line. Like that. Okay, but yeah, uh, like my graphics card right now is a NVIDIA 430, I believe, and that was out like five, six years ago. If anyone knows when, when it was released, like the first 430, like let me know in the comments. Like it's probably longer than five years, but it's definitely been about five years since I had those so in all likelihood like we might have to or I might have to actually buy a new graphic graphics card sometime soon and let's um, get some roads going while we talk but I may have to decide on whether I should really buy a new computer as in like just buy everything new again or just kind of like overhaul what I have so far. Like I think the only problem I have is, um, let's see, I think it's the motherboard which is also like 10, 11 years old maybe? And then 
Uh, let's see if I could hook this up here for a second. And then, um... And then my graphics card, I believe, is... Like... Five, three, four years old? Like, so somewhere around there. But anyways, like, it, it is... It is an old graphics card, and I should decide on whether I should buy a new one or or just kind of like play with this one until it actually dies. I haven't really made up my decision yet, but uh, hopefully in time if I can hook this up. But yep. Hopefully in time and hopefully I could buy it under budget because I just literally pissed away a lot of money during Boxing Day. And for those Americans who don't know what Boxing Day is, it's that day that comes after Christmas, and it's kind of like, um, it's kind of like that Friday shit that people freak out about. Am I actually saving right now? Alright, yeah. But yeah. It's that crazy moment where, like, or that crazy day where everyone's just, like, going around trying to buy things for their families and stuff like that. Hmm. I think I should make a... I should... I think I should make a bridge right here that goes up and over. That'd be kind of cool. Um... We are running out of... We're running out of spaces here. We might have to... We might have to cram a few houses few apartments here and then we'll get some offices oh no nope, those are not offices uh, office office there we go now uh, let's see what we got here full 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 ish can't believe it all of this is burning our trash right now and it's making us so much power. So on Boxing Day, I spent a lot of money. <laughs> to put it like plainly, plainly. Wow, I can't talk today. But yeah, to say it plainly, I've spent like a lot of money in terms of like buying a lot of airsoft stuff because uh, like if you follow my blog, I've been, uh, I've I've been getting myself into playing airsoft and stuff. So, like I might decide on doing some airsoft videos, maybe. But it seems like everything on YouTube is either airsoft, beauty, video games, music videos, or just ads. Like though those are like the three main things that I've seen. Like. Like, I don't want to fall into a niche, but at the same time, like, I could, I could bring in some people. Like, I haven't, like, played with anybody that I've known well enough to put on camera, but who knows? Maybe I'll find the time to get some money, get a camera, show you how shitty I am as a player. Uh, let's put more forestry all around. Because we do need that industry. And. Hmm. I wonder. Can I. Okay, if I put a large commercial sector here, and then I put kind of like offices here. Okay, so. Uh, for Airsoft, for this past weekend on Boxing Day. Um, I bought myself a airsoft pistol, and I decided to shoot with it, and it actually did pretty well, except for the fact that it's more delicate than an actual pistol, so, um, might have spent, like, ten, twenty dollars on buying replacement parts, because I'm pretty reckless, and also for the fact that, ooh, I like how the uh, I like how the train line is kind of lit up like that. That's kind of cool. But yeah, I spent um yeah I spent twenty dollars on 
airsoft stuff. And then on top of that, I bought a mystery box, which had like, like a guaranteed chance of like some loot, as well as like a chance to win like pistols. So I bought two of those, which brought me up to like $70 ish. And then I was like, if I'm going to get a pistol, I might as well get a holster. So I bought a holster. So that's another 25 and my total was like a hundred something for the entire weekend. Oh no. Oh no, they need water. I forgot to, I forgot to hook them up with water. Uh, here you go. Have some water. Water here. And everything's hooked up with water. Yes, everything's hooked up with water. And I'm gonna just do that. How's our power? Power not doing too good. I could place a windmill down. Like, that'll generate eight, but I really want this hydroelectric dam. Like, if I could... If I could harness the power of the water. Like, I just need, like, a good place to harv like harvest. Ooh. You know what? We might... We might actually do that. Uh, how much was that anyways? Because that generated a buttload of power. Like if we just hook that up there, I think that would be enough to last us for a little bit. Uh, looks like housing is doing pretty good. Uh, let's see, what else can we get here? Looks like they need hospitals. They're okay with... Um, I could buy a prison. Okay with police. Fire not so good. And health care is kinda dodgy. Yeah, so what we're gonna do is we could probably just get a hospital and like place it like here maybe. Like maybe maybe like along here. Actually, I kind of like it here, maybe. Yep. Boom. Hospital. Okay, let's see uh, where we're at in terms of having a grand city. We're almost to 19,000. Which is nice. Still not a capital city. A capital city will get us ship lanes, harbor, and then cloth city, cargo hub. What's this? Cargo Harbor that accepts also train traffic. Cargo Hub combines the functionality of a Cargo Harbor and Cargo Terminal, but there's also a slight synergy bonus for close proximity of both facilities and reduced truck traffic between the two buildings. That's kind of cool. And then we get an airport for Metropolis, and then we get an international airport for Megalop Megalopolis, which is 75 people. Ooh. We got a long ways to go. Okay, let's sort out the water problems right now. And then maybe we'll get working on the uh, power problems. Okay. So it looks like we... We might have to substitute with... I really don't want to put in another windmill. Because we don't really have space for that. Just don't have space, guys. Can you... Okay, you know what? I'm going to place it here, but I'm not going to be happy about it. Uh, let's see. And for water, we're going to get a water treatment plant. And we're going to... I think I'm going to mount it on, on this side. On the, on, on the commercial side of the harbor. So maybe... Maybe right, right there, and then we'll put a pipe like right there. There we go. There we go. Our first sewage treatment. That should reduce our our wastes a little bit. Might be kind of weird putting it near a commercial area, but uh, we're running pretty low on space so we're 
Trying to put it where no one can really see it. Even though when you're driving into town from like the forestry area, you see like this huge ass like shit stain of a fucking treatment plant. Um, could we add a windmill on this end? That thing right now. Can we add like a 8 megawatt windmill? Could. So we could pretty much turn this into like an, a giant wind farm. Just to like power this area. I might want to do that. It might take away some space, but at least we'll make like fuckloads of power. And I don't think I'm gonna fit in forestry here, but I'll, I'll, I'll probably do. Ooh, hello. Grand City, we have a solar power plant. Oh, sweet. Uh, let's see now. Solar power plant. I'm guessing it's gonna only work during the day, though. Let's see how big this thing is. Ooh, it's not that big. Could probably, like, put it, like... We could probably put it across the street. Couldn't we? Nope. Could we put it... Oh yeah, we could put it here. I'd be okay with that. Like, just having like a... wind farm right here. We could, we could probably put two. Can we? No? No? Okay. I think we should really add this prison now. Problem is, we gotta find like some remote place where the prison won't, wouldn't like, attract any attention. What we could do is we could like build like fuckloads of wind farms here and then just drop this here. That would be kind of cool though, just to have it in, like in the middle of nowhere where there's wind farms and stuff. I'm okay with that. I'll put it right here too. Yeah, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Okay. So what we're gonna do? Is we're gonna um, we're gonna take this road, and we're gonna um, we're gonna make it straight. We're gonna we're gonna do a straight road here, and then it's gonna go up like here and across and. Back. Can I get there? We go. Right there. And let's see. We could put it like right there. So, like you probably can't see this, but like it, it'll start winding from the trees on the bottom. And it'll come right up, and I'll just have it sit on side on the side of the road. So if I can show you, I'll place a road kind of like here, and then let's see. Should I? Yeah, I'm gonna just have it like curve around. So I'll go like kind of like that, and then it's gonna gonna curve around again like like something like that and then I'll just link up here like that okay let's put let's put in some plumbing that will go all the way out here uh and let's add the prison. No, let's not add the prison just yet. Let's let's get a couple wind farms going. So eight eight megawatts. Eight megawatts. And I think I'm gonna put one eight megawatt right there. And then we need, we need another eight somewhere. Can we, can we fit eight? Nope. Okay. So it looks like we're gonna be making, we're gonna be making some power for the prison here. Kind of like that. 
and we'll just place right there. There we go. Now it's got power. Inmates serving their punishment. There's 500 for capacity, and then we we have five prison vans. Let's take a good look at this prison. That's kind of neat. If I can uh, get rid of that tooltip. Look at that. We got ourselves a nice little prison. I would expect a little bit more out of the prison, but uh, I'm okay with that. That's a nice little prison. There's ac there's actually like benches and stuff in there. That's kind of cool. So yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be just like the prison grounds, and we'll probably add more prisons like around this area. Hopefully by the time this goes out, it'll be either the 31st of December or the 1st of January. Because I would like to I I like to start fresh with something we've brought along from the old year. That way like it seems like there's some continuity and I haven't like left my channel to have some holiday time off. Cause in reality I have too much time off so I might as well do something for you guys right? Please tell me. Yep. Yep it's disappearing. It's disappearing. That's good. Oh no. No. I don't know. It's going in and out. Um. Oh, they they need water, okay. They need water. They need water. Um Okay. Okay, we're gonna stop that for a second. Uh water, 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 water. Water 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 water. Uh water. There you go. I'll hook it up. Like here. There you go. Some people aren't gonna be happy, but who knows? And what we could do is we could could take some power lines from here and then kind of do that do that and there we go so now it's looking fairly much like an industrial area here it's gonna be mostly commercial and stuff but at the same time there's gonna just be like the general like work of trucks and stuff coming here. This should take a strain off of that huge highway that we have back here. Even though this thing is fucking backed up. Holy shit, look at that. That thing is backed up. Where the hell are you guys going? Okay, we might have to actually institute a highway system now. We might have to actually do it. But the question is, I don't know exactly how to really implement this. Okay, let's try... Let's try upgrading these roads first. This might... This might bankrupt us, but... As long as... Traffic's running, we should be good, right? So, like that. And that should be fine. Right? Well, it's... it's... it's working. Kind of. It's not as fast as I would assume, but it's, it's working. Like, there's a lot of traffic moving in and out, but I'm not too sure if it's actually filling up or emptying out. I'm hearing lights flickering, so... Do we have a power problem? Do we have a problem? Um, uh, maybe in the future. Everything's looking pretty good now. Like, I'm definitely thinking about building it here because it looks like this area could potentially have a lot of power. Uh, let's see how much money that we could spend on this. Apparently we can't build here. What? Are we serious? I can't I can't build there? Fuck me. That fucking sucks. Okay. 
So I can't build on that side. Let's see if I could build on this side. If I if I had the choice, uh, could I build a hydro hydroelectric dam right here? Uh, I don't think there's enough power. Like I'll I'll get like 200 ish off of it. Hmm. What if I bought out this tile though? Nope. What if I did this? 48. So pretty much anywhere downstream, I'll get the most. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Now what if I do this? Like, let's assume I actually built the built the little dam right here. Okay. That's not. That's no good. Um. Could I build a dam right here? That's not going to be enough. Like I would like a lot of power to come from it, but at the same time, like, like I wish I could build right here. That would have been great. Like, 336 right there. But no, I got, I got this piece of shit right here. So far, we've been only making power from wind and trash. <laughs> Those are the two main things that we're running on right now: wind and trash. Mm, we could get another garbage incinerator down. How's everyone doing on garbage, by the way? Everyone's actually pretty happy. That's a first. Um, what's going on over here? Dead person waiting for transport. Apparently, someone got shanked in the uh, in the prison. Like I think a prison riot like broke out or something. That a jeep all the way from the Maple Residence. Work at the incinerator plant, driving home. I don't know why you decide to pick that route, but like the incinerator is right there. You could have easily drove yourself like out of here. All right. Oh, uh, that we got that done. I think we'll uh. Well, end the episode off here. I think I'm pretty happy with this right now. So, thank you guys for watching.